Hello, Gloria. Instructor Pamela here. Thank you for your engagement within the discussion forum relating to preparing for your CCSP for physician reimbursement and coding. Please keep in mind that as you understand the rules that, that apply in the real world does not necessarily apply with uh, during taking the examination. So with that being said, please be sure to follow the instructions verbatim when you are sitting for the examination. Now as far as outpatient coding, you always need a diagnosis code and you always need a service procedure code, which is either going to be from your CPT book, from the evaluation and management section, or from the surgery section, or from the medicine section. It depends on the treatment that the patient is receiving. And then a HICPIX code would be applied if the service actually provided a HICPIX item such as a wheelchair, it could be a prosthetic limb, it could be a cataract implant, it could be medication. So again, in outpatient coding, you always need a diagnosis code and you always need a service code. And on the CMS 1500 claim form, which is used for outpatient coding, there is a pointer box that connects the, the procedure or service with the diagnosis. So that how, that's how it is done and performed in basically real life and the computer um, helps us process all of this. So my question for you is where in the CPT book can you find information or the tool used for ENM? In your CPT book there will be information about evaluation and management of how to choose the proper code and how do you do so. There are particular tools that you can use to help you with that. Thank you very much. This is Instructor Pamela. Until next time, journey well.